Hello everybody, welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies, everyone's favorite series, clearly. <laughs> so... If this is your- okay, today's interactive comment. <laughs> what?! If this- so if this is your favorite me. series, um, comment down below, because I want to, uh, chat with you as to why. I'm yeah, very curious I, as to why this would be your favorite Me series. too, but in a more positive light than Aiden, because like, gee whiz, man. I, I'm just a little confused, I guess. <laughs> Um, a three shooter. Um, we'll just do walnuts. We don't it's need like the Pokemon. We don't need the Tangle Kelp. That sounds really boring. That sounds really boring. All right. I use my brain to express myself. Now, <laughs> when you look into the sky, what do you see? <laughs> Nothing. I see a city face. Wow. Walking around, smiling at me. I don't see what you mean. Cause you're not thinking creatively. Take a look at my hair. I use my hair to express myself. That sounds really boring. <gasps> That's what we should do. We should <laughs> dub over Don't Hug Me I'm Scared. <laughs> okay. With Grant. <clears throat> um, there's instrumentals of the stuff, so it would be really easy to. Hmm. Um, well, okay, here's a question for you, Dalton. What's okay. your favorite Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared episode? The first one is solely because it's just a classic. Personally, I am more of a computer guy. I like the computer I also one. like time. Um, because mucking around. <laughs> There's a time and a place for mucking around. <laughs> like birthdays and capping. I'm friends with my dad. <laughs> Simon. My daddy's got the computer. Ooh. Oh, frick, we eat the dub steamed hams tonight. We do. So, um, let's think about this. Okay, so this is kind of, like I said, going to be our story time for a while, so. Do you want me to pull out the list and stuff? I already have mine open if you, or I know, Ooh, I know what mine are. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Okay, so, first of all. I have started, well, I, I've worked at Dairy Queen for quite a while. I believe we've covered this in previous episodes. Aiden will soon be there with me. Dab. The problem with this, well, not the problem, the thing about that is that it's given me a lot of stories, right? So, first of all, I want to tell you all the story of um, what happened when I was closing the other night. So, mm. one of the things that is involved in closing is turning off the fryers. We have, like, the fryers that make the fried food, obviously. I those fryers. <laughs> so, I was told by our manager to turn off the fryers. Now, I'd never done this before, so I said, okay, so what do you do? Oh, it's easy. Just open the door and... Wait, wait. The, the lady manager or the... They're all, they're all lady managers, okay. yes. Um, but uh, she was just like, okay, yeah, just uh, open the door and uh, turn the thingy. She said, and I quote, turn the thingy and it'll turn off. Now, I didn't know what the thingy was, so I opened the door and I saw this big red latch or the big like handle thing. I'm like, okay, yeah, that seems about gonna right. kill him? Yeah, it, it will. Gonna... Are you... Nope. Okay, so, anyway, I saw the, just a big red handle, and I was like, okay, yes, this is probably the thingy. <laughs> it wasn't the thingy. You know what, you know what the big red handle does? Is it ejects all of the boiling grease out the front of the thing. <laughs> so, I got boiling grease all over the floor, and it, like, poured out, and I burnt my leg because, of it. like, you can see this, like, burn mark on my leg. Oof. Um... It was not a fun experience, and I'm like, you told me to turn the thingy! And she's like, the other thingy! And apparently there's a little knob that has, like, numbers on it that I couldn't see from where I was standing, but... Wow. If you ever turn off the fryers, do not, under any circumstances whatsoever, pull the red handle. I will handle. not rev them up, I promise. No. <laughs> Don't pull the red handle, just... Because I'm sure not up. hungry. Oh, I mean... yeah, noted. <laughs> Why are you still up? <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm gonna send this, uh... I'm not editing that in, just before you ask. I'm still gonna send it to you. Okay. Poop. There we go, it's sending. <laughs> wow. Um, there's a picture of a guy in a Barney suit holding a little girl against his crotch or something. There's That's not peak how I meme material. It. <laughs> Ooh, diamonds. diamonds. Oh, that's actually really good because it means we get the next thing. You know that they're one. unbreakable? Yes. Yes, they are. Yes, I am. 
Um, but yeah, I'm gonna start working in there. Uh, I had I went in for my interview, and it went really good. But basically, the only thing was she was like, "Well, since we have like we're working with deep fryers now, it's be 16. So uh, <laughs> come out on your birthday, and then uh, we'll uh, we'll hire you then or something." I was like, "Oh, okay." But if they don't hire me, then I'm gonna be very disappointed, cause I could use this time to like search for other jobs. Uh, you should be fine. They they seem pretty well. And like, if people are leaving for the summer, like I'm gonna work during the school year, so. Basically, what you want to know is if you're ever working with a dude named Patrick, it's gonna turn out really well because he's like, he does everything extremely fast, and you barely have to do anything. Oh, sweet. That sounds pretty good. You can put down a lily pad if you want. Like, why can ya? There's just you know, some, some more point at the moment. little duties. Down our double guy. A double guy. Our redstone repeater. <laughs> down one of those lily pads again. Wow. Angel. I'm just on lily pad duty. Just making sure I don't forget. This is how you don't fall asleep. You stay on lily pad duty and you'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, tell me some stories. Let's hear Alright. Aiden story time. Frickin'. Frickin'. Oh, frick, we got a new, uh... Oh, it's the guy from the live stream. Whoa. He joined our Discord server, so... Wait, who's the guy from the live stream? The guy that commented, uh... Uh, good stuff or something. Oh, okay. Uh, it's your boy. So, that's fun. Not to warm anybody, but AJ Wood has just entered the chat, ladies and gentlemen. Do you know an AJ Wood? I do know AJ... How did AJ Wood... Oh, no, I know who... I know how AJ Wood found it Andrew? It, it's through Andrew, yes. AJ oh. Wood worked... Or, well, he didn't work, but he went to the Circleville. Oh, nice. What do I reply to this with? I'll, 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 I'll say hi to him. AJ okay. Wood, if you somehow find us finding you in this episode, hello. <laughs> Kudos to you. For actually watching the Lights the <laughs> Zombies. <laughs> mm. Alright, so... Oh, frick. Alright, so... Okay, I'm gonna say my Mario Maker stories with Spencer. Oh, yeah. So I was over at Spencer's house, um, like, a like last weekend, I think, and... He's like, all right, so I got Mario Maker 2, and I want you to play some of my levels. And I was like, okay. He was like, how hard can they be? The answer, um, not really that difficult. <laughs> the, the One of them has a 0% clear rate, and I don't really see why. Either people just give up instantly. Um, Probably or, that. It's like, know. oh, I played this. This looks hard. Not playing this anymore. Yeah, it's called end. the Gauntlet. It's, it is pretty challenging, but, like, nothing, like, mind-numbingly difficult. Like, there's, okay, so there's a section with four troll blocks. Um, he's like, alright, there's a, there's a one in four chance you get this right, and I get it right on my first try, and it's like, well, frick. <laughs> <laughs> and then we were playing, like, online levels of other people, uh, like, later, and he's saying, like, man, I was so good at Mario Maker 2 when I first played this, and, like, I'm so much better than you are, I'm like, Spencer, what the heck? And then I die. And then it's his turn, and he literally dies by just walking into a Goomba within the first two <laughs> seconds of the level. I was like, hmm, you really are better than me, Spencer, you're right. <laughs> and then he just kind of got tired and started watching his videos <laughs> on his phone. Just like you, except it's Instagram. Okay, but I'm not watching my own content on Instagram. Well, he watches his own content? Yeah. Okay. I mean, like, I do too, but not as, like, a pleasure viewing. It's more of a, like, hey, did this turn out well? That's what I do with my covers sometimes, like... Yeah, yeah, I can see that. Just to make sure, like, I didn't upload it to YouTube but and I, the quality what? suddenly dipped oh. for some reason. Oh, we got a car key! Nice, so now we get the car, which you're allowed to Wait, drive what? into zombies. Oh, Actually, plants can do this. that? Hey, you found my car. <laughs> okay, so we can buy eight slots. Easy. Uh, we can buy a pool cleaner. Oh, you don't even have enough. Ooh, what are the double sun things? It's a, it's this double sunflower upgrade. They basically, you put it on a sunflower and oh. it produces two sun every time. Hmm. Alright. Oh, yeah. So you want to hear another story? Thing about the song oh, you. process. Sometimes it makes them come out real little. Real little. On a real like mean baby zombies. Shins. Just, just watch this. It's weird. <laughs> <laughs> Low quality zombies. Okay. Um, here's another story. So you know Spencer's ex Callie, right? Mm-hmm. Well, um, 
you know, we're no, we or we were known to joke around with each other, um, in the form of like what some might say insults. I call um, you Rose. know, just just gesturing and like roasting Friendly in a banter. comedy um, way, and she she can't take jokes well. Callie so, or like, Spencer. Callie. Well, that neither. I was gonna say either, um, either of them really. So her brother texts me. Well, okay. Backstory on me and his relationship. Uh, freaking, he was like at some youth event that Anna was at, and he was trying to get people to fight him. So I was like, "All right, score up." Bro. What? Like over, I was calling Anna, so I wasn't like actually there, but he was like trying to get people to fight him or something. Uh, so I was like, "All right, I can definitely take this white kid who plays baseball." Because <laughs> like, first baseball off, players. if you play baseball. I don't respect you. No, okay. Because baseball just sucks. Like, no offense to you, but come on, you really had to pick baseball as your sport? Really? Really? I mean, but, I mean... I mean, it's... It's personal preference. I don't think it's I don't like... Know. Um, but anyway, so uh, he texted me, was like, alright, when do you want to fight? I was <laughs> like, uh, I don't know. He's like, pick a spot, and then I just never replied, because I was like, I'm have time to fight no, you. No, what you I'm do, too busy. what you do if someone does that is you pick some spot oh, that's yeah. like freaking hours away <laughs> and see if they drive there and just just <laughs> assume that they're not going to and say, dude, you didn't even meet me there. Wow. It's, I've done, that's well, I've not done that before, but I, I've known someone who I've encouraged to do that and they did and it was hilarious. But anyway, he texted me later. He was like, yo, I heard you talking crap about my sister or something. I'm like, <laughs> what? Okay. Um, he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. She, t she talks to me about it. And she's like, you know, it really hurts her and stuff. And I was like, what are you talking about, dude? <laughs> um, so he's like, freaking, you do that again. I don't, I don't like that. Why don't, why don't you square up? You're, too, you're such a <laughs> pussy to fight me. Come on, bro. Square up. Like, dude, what are you talking about? He really just wants to fight. I don't even think. <laughs> I don't even think he actually has any, like, problems with you. <laughs> he just really wants to fight someone. <laughs> but, I don't know, so it, like, started, like, he was calling me, like, a dickwad or something for, like, <laughs> no, it wasn't even that. He called me a white stick. <laughs> what? <laughs> so, I don't even know if that's an insult or not. I mean. Well, no one knows what that <laughs> means yet. Uh, but anyway, so, he's, like, telling me to shut up and stuff, and then he sends, like, 12 paragraphs of information just like ridiculing me or something i don't know i like, didn't really understand it but hayden was like dog you should fight this guy and i was like yeah i probably should but i don't have time because oh i gotta take time out of my busy schedule to <laughs> fist fight someone <laughs> whatever works but it was just really weird like if you hit me up saying that you want to fight me why <laughs> reconsider your life please I don't know. That's that was that story. I don't. Duh. It's not that good of a story, but it's something that happened to me. It's like, like I said, the tell someone to fight you at a location that's really far away. Because either the, any result is hilarious. Either they don't go there, and you can just say, "Wow, you didn't even bother to show up," or they did go there, and you can laugh at them for driving for hours for no reason. <laughs> Do you wanna? Hey, should I hear about my child pornography account that followed me on Instagram? What? <laughs> what? Started liking all my posts. I'm sorry, what? So, That's just a heck of a sentence you just dropped. I, right I'm there. waiting to report him until after I talk about it. <laughs> um, where, where'd he go? Did he already get taken down? <laughs> yeah. Well, that was fast. So is this one account that posts, like, I don't know, little boys and like bathing suits and stuff and it's oh. really weird and they started liking my posts and stuff which ironically this is the second time if i had a nickel for every time this has happened to me i'd have <laughs> two nickels which isn't a lot but it's weird that it happened twice um don't pee oh, we already got all of the achievements they carry over accounts never mind nice i was gonna say we we're gonna go for one if we could but um ooh. anyway oh frick it's probably time no we got we, we're doing one more even still okay. Yeah, oh we're yeah, we're fine. Um, this is a longer series, but it's. But anyway, it's just yeah. really weird. Like, why? That's <laughs> it. Just why? Why would why? Why? Why would you? Why? Why would you? Why? 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 But, <laughs> yeah. The internet's a weird place, kids. Stay safe. What? What did he like? Did he just follow you and nothing else, or? Um. 
Yeah, pretty much. He started, like, liking all my posts and stuff. Oh. Only the ones that, like, had me in them. It's like, if you repost my pictures, I'm calling the police. Jokes on, I'm immune to child predators. <laughs> you just, you know, not immune to normal predators. But normal, normal predators. <laughs> like Dominic. <laughs> yeah, well, that's like a reverse child predator situation. It's like... <laughs> Where a child's predating an adult. Please, uh, don't take me to court. <laughs> oh, uh, I don't think I've said this on uh, camera yet, but Bella Delphine's Instagram got freaking deleted. Well, so let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I mean, I stopped following her after her. Um, you, you were following her to begin with. Is oh what oh yeah. <laughs> I mean, Aiden, you were the target audience of Gamer Bathwater. I okay. I would not buy Gamer Bathwater. Gamer That's... Girl P, though, on the other hand, mm, pour me up a piping hot glass of that stuff. Thank I'm you. totally joking, by the way. No one take me seriously. Thank you, on Jarno. This. Very cool. <laughs> Doesn't the Scout drink pee? I saw one meme about it where it was like, uh, Giorno and like the Scout or something from TF2. No. I don't know. But, uh. The, the sniper throws jars of pee at Yeah, people. I think it's that one. And I the, don't know. The scout throws bottles of what is described as non-milk substance at people. Oh, so it is milk? assumed that he the mad milk. Yes, it is assumed that he jerks off into a jar. Did you say mad milk? Yes. It's man milk. No, it's mad milk is the name of the item. Oh. Hmm. Well, welcome to TF2, I guess. It's a weird game. I'll tell you what. I bet. We have so much sun, holy crap. Yeah, we just we just plant roses, sunflowers, make the game really easy. We should probably start planting actual uh, plants. We we have we just want to stockpile. I mean Fair point, counterpoint. We start uh, putting in our armies so we don't have to wait for them to recharge each Counterpoint, time. shut the frick up. Counter counterpoint, no. Commit uh you not that like a seven second die. freaking. There we go. All right, Dalton, what's a good story you can tell us? I'm trying to think of some because it's like, son. I know I have some stories. I'm a man of many stories. Have I told the time that I was at AMC for seven hours? Oh my god, what did you so, watch at AMC? Hold on, I'll tell the story then. So. Uh, the movie yesterday comes out. I really want to see it. I convinced my mom to take me and Noah. So we go and see yesterday. On the way up, Tucker's like, hey, you want to go see Endgame? And I was like, uh, kind of seeing, kind of, uh, yeah, kind of seeing a movie right now. He's like, oh, okay. Um, I'm just gonna go see an AMC. So I looked at the show times. It started 15 minutes after yesterday ended. So it was like, all right, let's go see Endgame. So... <laughs> Uh, I get to the theater, watch yesterday, very good film, um, he did a really good job of covering the Beatles songs in a believable way, and it's a really good, uh, interesting plot, too, uh, I don't know if you've seen the trailer or anything, but it's like, I, I know yeah. generally what the yeah. movie is, yeah, so, it was good, then Tucker got there, we waited, like, there was like an hour in between or something, actually, so we just sat down, out, wait, and like, waited for the theater to be ready and just talked and stuff then we spent like three and a half hours in endgame so overall i was there for a really long time oh check this out it's a new guy oh sweet and he basically does this and creates an ice trail but yeah it was really fun like i'd definitely uh, do it again I, okay, so I've always wanted to do that. I, I call it just like movie hopping, basically, where you buy. Wait, but I pay for a ticket though. Uh, well, it, it's where it's what the real bad boys do is you pay for one ticket and then. The thing is, I like my AMC. If we're going to like Cinemark or something, I do that. But I don't want to get kicked out of my Grove City AMC. That's my movie location. I, you're not gonna get kicked out if you're not stupid. Basically, you just get like a large popcorn. Oh yeah, bobsled zombies also they. They'll ride the ice, like, all the way in. Nice. So we're just gonna delete them. Red Hot Chili Peppers. Red, red Hot the Chili Peppers. <laughs> you know what's really sad? Okiasu's stand was the perfect stand to kill his father, but his brother didn't want to have to put him through that. <laughs> so what you think about anyway, Place pad? Anyway... Um, and in regards to your movie thing, 
basically what you do, because I think like at AMC, like a large popcorn and large refills, drinks. Yeah. yeah, you get you just get a free refill. So well, you get a free refill on the drinks infinitely since it's the Coke free styles. Oh yeah, but you get one free refill on the popcorn. Well, again, if you it de it depends on who's working there. So if you play everything perfectly right and like you are able to like know when the employee switch ships or whatever go in for one movie make sure there are at least three movies that you want to see if not four go in be a while mm, yeah it is a long it would be a long time but it's like that's a long episode yeah it's a long one but this is this game is a little bit longer yeah. shout out if you're still watching this right now hopefully we've kept it pretty entertaining um but yeah, this is tutorial for all you, uh, all you kids out there who want to try this. Um, we should vlog ourselves doing it. <laughs> we, we totally could. So... Oh, we got a spike weed. Oh, nice. Speed. And we'll have to find out what that does next time. Thanks for watching. Right, bye.